The eight point blocking system looks to be one of the most advanced systems that we've seen in a modern boxing game. But will it be too complex to really be practical? Now for anyone that's unaware, the eight point blocking system is going to give you manual control over eight different directions of where you want to block. Unlike the default system where you're really just gonna be able to block high and low. Mastery of this system is going to come at a price and that's time. But for my defensive wizards out there, taking this system and incorporating it with the loose footwork plus the slip and weave mechanics that are in the game are really going to take defense to an all new level. Once mastered, you will be able to slip, weave, catch and shoot, transition offense to defense and defense to offense. All of that together is really going to be a thing of beauty. But with most manual systems, there is a payoff, goods and bads. The thing is, is that the positives usually have to match the amount of time that is put into it to actually master the system. Boxing is chess, it's not checkers. And when it comes to defense, you cannot afford to choose wrong. Otherwise, you will get punished severely. In an eight point manual system, you will always be subject to choosing incorrectly. In a default system where the only two options you have to worry about is up and down, your chances are really 50-50. Now, during the content creator event, we actually offered a lot of feedback when it came to things like slipping and punching and weaving and punching and things like that so that we could transition and put our combinations and continue to flow the way that we needed to. Now, taking this system into consideration, it is actually a very strong piece of that. If everything is put together correctly, being that this game is still in alpha development, you could essentially be able to not only guard while weaving and slipping, but also punishing your opponent all at the same time, bringing together the full aspect of boxing. Now, being that this game is advertised as an esport, we have to ask ourselves what is the payoff of taking manual versus semi automatic mode? This is where I feel like we need more information from Steel City Interactive. As of right now, the current explanation that we have is more about feeling and enjoyment, whether you want to play a more simulation style of game or whether you want to play a more arcade style of game. But as I stated, this is an eSport and we do know that tournaments are going to be a part of this game's life cycle at some point in the future. What are going to be the rules of competition? Is every person going to have to use semi-automatic mode or will everybody have to use strictly manual? Ultimately, I believe this system will create a gap between who is your hardcore fan and who is your casual player. And no doubt when the game drops, this system is going to be one of the most highly talked about things when you're talking about career mode and especially online play. We know that everything that we do is really based off of risk reward, but at the same time, when it comes to competition, you're talking about wins and losses. And if playing in semi-automatic mode nets you more wins, then a lot of people are going to transition away from it unless they see an advantageous benefit to using the manual mode. For my offline only players, this is an easy choice. It's just how you want to have fun with the game. Do you want a more simulation style or do you want an arcade game? But for my online competitors out there, what type of defender will you be? eight point blocking or semi-automatic. Ultimately, I believe that the eight point blocking system is going to revolutionize defense and combat sports games for a very, very long time. But will this be too complex of a system for the upcoming community? This is being advertised also as a simulation boxing game, man. And I feel like I would be robbing myself of a real experience if I did not use the eight point blocking system but it ain't really about me, it's about you all. So please, if you could, down in the comment section below, let me know whether you think this is too complex and you're just going to go with the semi-automatic mode or if you're just really can't wait, man, to try this eight point blocking system out to really get that sim feeling. So I can tell you guys every other time, man, appreciate y'all for coming back to the Coach's Corner and I will catch you on the next one. Peace out.